Ethereum to $1,000 in 2020. Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel. In today's video guys, I'll be talking about Ethereum 2.0, I'll be talking about Ethereum staking, I'll be talking about proof of stake, I'll be talking about Ethereum DeFi, how DeFi coins are going up massively and why Ethereum is one of the key players in it. it lots of DeFi coins are going up 100%, 200%. I'll be showing with exactly how I've been trading Ethereum. So this is not an after the fact. I'll be showing for the past couple of months exactly how I've been trading it. You can check out my proof uh, video, YouTube videos for proof, or you can check out the group. I'll talk about the how I'm trading Ethereum, where I'm buying, where I'm selling. And I'll be talking about other coins as well, some of the other coins that are going up, especially the DeFi coins that are going up, and I'm sharing exactly how we've been trading it. So without further ado, let's get into the video video so ethereum guys is breaking 400 dollars which is a huge resistance level this looks like a really nice basing structure we've seen gold and silver breaking up massively and bitcoins broken out previously after Bitcoin broke out. Ethereum had that huge rally with Ethereum 2.0, with DeFi projects, with what's going on in the world markets. Ethereum can have a huge run. And if Ethereum has a huge run, there could be other coins that are, are uh, going up. We've seen SXP going up, Comp do 100%, Algo. I've talked about Algo. Check out the previous video uh, on my YouTube video. Uh, on once a month, I share a YouTube video where I talk about which coins to buy. Uh, Algo was talked about about a couple of. Well, a week ago that has gone parabolic if you are interested in finding out how to trade if ethereum breaks out this could be an opportunity of a lifetime with altcoins breaking out and we are really lucky to know about cryptocurrency i'll leave the links below if you are interested to find us more there's a special offer going on the monthly offer is 30 dollars, and there's a special offer on the yearly you can get in for less than 160 pounds if you click on the through paypal on a through if you click subscribe you'll get that special offer through paypal so Let's talk about Ethereum. I'll, I'm, I'll come to my chart and I'll share with you exactly how I'm trading it. And if you're not in Ethereum, I'll be sharing with you how you can look to get in and your profit targets. But let's talk about Ethereum 2.0. So Ethereum 2.0 is expected to launch this year. Uh, it marks a long anticipated upgrade to Ethereum. Uh, Ethereum, you know the previous history of Ethereum. These are some of the updates it has already had. And the main changes that are happening to Ethereum are Ethereum proof of stake, which, are, which I've been really looking forward to this is this for me is the main difference uh, from ethereum 1.0 to 2.0 and short chains which helps with scalability and proof of work we already know the issues with the, the electricity the, the slowness it, this proof of stake is extremely secure it, it, it helps with the scalability and accessibility of proof of work which bitcoin is on and ethereum is just taking cryptocurrency to the next level which i've talked about previously uh, if we look at some price charts i'll talk about um a calculator if people are interested in staking i'll touch on uh, on staking ethereum if you are interested um, some people are going to message me about staking cardano and other coins i might make a video on it but as a validator of ethereum you can stake ethereum to get reward and you can use this calculator to get it but ethereum if we look at prices previously with some of the updates it has had especially this one bz atm that was one of the key ones that's when we broke out and had a huge fomo rally and if it breaks out again you can see a nice basing strategy Structure, this can have another rally and when things FOMO guys there's no limit to how high it can go one of the coins are, uh, we've been trading massively is Chainlink you can check the previous videos out in YouTube from a couple of months ago not recently of when Ch Chainlink broke out how I've been trading it in the YouTube I share with you exactly which coins I'm buying what levels to buy in the educational group I share with you exactly when I'm buying what levels I'm buying where my stop is going so Ethereum if it breaks out can have a rally and when things FOMO there's no limit on how high it can go so I showed you how the price affected when um, previously on updates. So this update is obviously catching the imagination. And one thing that has helped push the imagination to the next level is DeFi, decentralized finance. And Ethereum is playing the biggest role on it. So it's going to be phased out. So these are some of the phases. If you are interested, I'll make a detailed video on uh, Ethereum 2.0. And I'll talk about each of the phases. I've personally read it all myself. And I love what they're trying to do. I really hope Vitalik Buterin can... Uh, 
provide what they're saying so ethereum has been a long anticipated proof of stake and sharding will bring considerable improvements to scalability security and accessibility f holders ethereum 2.0 provides a new opportunities to participate in rewards for manipulate maintaining the network for those who wish to run their own validators with 32 f use a third party provider to stake their 32 f or pool their funds with others and ethereum ecosystem will host a number of products and solutions including consensus pegasus and codify teams so if you are interested in staking you can check it out i really hope uh, vitalik butrin can deliver on this promise so we've talked about ethereum final testnet set to launch on august the 4th so it's going really well after discussions with client teams the next multi-client testnet mainnet config including minimum validator numbers will have minimum genesis time of august the f uh, august 4th so we can see that they are progressing quite well three months of successful testing network under pressure with defy boom and i've talked about a couple of defy coins out and ethereum is playing the main role in defy defy digens are gaming ethereum's um um uh, money logos first there were attendees and wi-fi then came and went yam and as of yesterday we have based money uh, today's de decentralized finances in what amounts of crossover between multiple player online mmo games like what world of warcraft and crypto pump and dump schemes and it's playing the games playing the games even if you don't know the rule but what i can say is defy is having a huge part one of the things i mean a lot of the coins that defy projects that i'm trading at the moment in the group they're quickly they're better for going in and out rather than just hodling some of the coins I've posted about and some of the very small uh, ultra small up coins we were taking previously you know they've gone thousands of percents again I don't promise all those claims sometimes you get them you're risking money and it de depends a lot on the market first move where Ethereum faces inflation problems as gas fees so this is a problem that Ethereum is facing congestion is building on Ethereum blockchain the second largest blockchain thanks to the recent popularity of dollar link stable coins and decentralized finance application like compound so compound is another trade that we took i can uh, share that with you compound has been one of the better trades i took comp uh, i can share with you the chart so people talk about defy coins comp is a co uh, coin that i traded uh, quite well so comp had a huge breakout and we're seeing loads of coins break out like this lend if you are in the cryptocurrency markets lend had a huge breakout it just broke out almost out of nowhere this is where comp was i posted exactly where i was buying where i was selling and comp went up hundreds percent it was really it was a really good trade i actually sold comp uh, a lot earlier i sold comp here i'm looking for another trade if comp breaks out i'll be looking for another trade at the moment i'm waiting to see if comp breaks out but this was a breakout in comp similar to ethereum pulled back here using my pullback strategy so in the educational group you get access to the unit course uh, the introduction to my course and you can see uh, a heavy strategy because if we do get an altcoin season most people won't make money because they won't know when to sell where to when to buy when to sell and even if they do buy things will go up and down they wouldn't sell so let's come back to ethereum and i've talked about defy and ethereum this defy boom is putting pressure on the uh, on the eth ecosystem and we can see what's happening and also defy exchanges uh, decentralized exchanges is also having an effect on ethereum ethereum is being the center of this mini boom in cryptocurrency that we're seeing ethereum decentralized trading hits nearly half a billion in 24 hours like i've talked about so decentralized exchanges are booming uniswap is another exchange that i'm looking at um that i look to trade because there's some coins on there that have gone a thousand percent i've shared a couple with the group and again uniswap is very risky if you ha i always say don't trade with a lot of amount only trade with little amount on this those exchanges because they can they're very risky but those where you can get the crazy coins pumping thousands of percent so that's my thoughts on ethereum again if you're interested i'll talk in detail about ethereum or ethereum 2.0 what each of the phases are go through facts go through the reports but that's my uh, what what i wanted to share with you about ethereum 2.0 but let's talk about the price now which i think most people are interested in so ethereum guys had a huge breakout and the main breakout we saw in ethereum was in july and i can share that with you uh, 
know exactly when I traded Ethereum because people say have you actually traded it um, and so this is the 13th of August trade that we've taken this was yesterday it was a couple of days ago that I traded but if you scroll down you can see every day I've been posting doing live streams get access to course and other people are trading this was 22nd of July as you can see where I bought Ethereum and I posted uh, mainly Ethereum BTC because I look at Ethereum and Ethereum BTC I moved a lot of my Bitcoin into Ethereum this was when it broke out as you can see uh, this is where I got in and it is carried on going up it's at big resistance now so I'll look to get in on a pullback again if Ethereum BTC breaks out above 3800 guys I think Ethereum BTC could head a lot lot higher I don't want to make crazy predictions on Ethereum BTC but this is resistance I think it could probably move sideways for a bit this is a profit level but Ethereum USD is definitely looking more bullish so that was the first trade in Ethereum that I posted in the group and now it's here uh, and it's broken out again and this breakout was a couple of days ago and I can uh, show you how we've traded this one as well Ethereum broke out and I'm in Ethereum as long as it stays below 3500 against BTC and about 406 against USD I am long so some people longed Ethereum USD at about four, $400 or wherever they got in had their stop loss below where I said $4.06 and it's been carrying on I've taken half off and I'm letting it run so how can you get in great Rocco you've made money and your group members made money but how can I make money at the moment so what I'm what I am looking for is guys as long as Ethereum Ethereum stays above four hundred dollars, uh, four hundred, uh, three hundred eighty dollars. I think Ethereum will head towards next. I mean, uh, it's crazy saying five hundred dollars, but if you look at resistance wise, that's where my next Fibonacci target is four sixty to five hundred dollars, and that's what I'll be targeting. I'm still in Ethereum. If Ethereum breaks below three sixty a spike below is fine this is where my long-term stop is where I've got an ethereum if it comes into about 400 level I would look for a pullback entry my stop will go below 36 excuse me 360 but if we don't bounce from this 50-60% zone, sometimes you, you get spikes. I don't want to be spiked out. So that's one of the, uh, I'm doing a live stream. So I do live streams three to four times a week. I'm doing a live stream tomorrow. And one of the things I'll talk about is stop loss. Where to place your stop loss. If you don't place your stop loss, you're gambling. It's very important to put your stop loss. That's what I'll talk about. So this is the strategy I'm looking at. So around the 400, 390 to 410 is where I'm looking to buy. The 50%, 61% pullback around the four hour pullback zone and um, if, if you've not got any exposure you could look to buy some with a long stop loss and look to buy more on a pullback if ethereum gets back below 360 guys we could be having a bigger pullback again there's no guarantee we're going to see that huge move up i'm very bullish in ethereum with what we have seen and i think that's the next target as long as it doesn't get back below this is what i've been sharing even when i took the trade here guys i said if it gets back below 260 i won't be interested we are trading we're not gambling i'm not making Making, there's loads of other YouTubers that will talk about, you know, if the uh, XRP to a thousand five eight nine, uh, chain link to thousand dollars or whatever. But if Ethereum, you know, gets back above it, I will initially look to target five hundred and six hundred levels. But if it does have a rally and keep staying above those key support and resistance level, I think Ethereum can have a huge rally. And looking at support and resistance on a weekly time frame, there's not much resistance. You can see if it breaks this zone, it could potentially be that eight hundred dollar level, which is crazy to think about. Ethereum BTC, I said. It's at, it's at resistance now but if it breaks this red resistance zone hit, it breaks above weekly uh, 200 moving averages already above all the key moving averages then my next target would be around the 450 to sorry the 5000 satoshi level if it breaks this zone this is a huge resistance zone around the 4000 if it breaks above it 382 i will be targeting that level so those are my targets that's my strategy to get in hopefully you guys enjoyed your, this video we're really lucky to know about ethereum and cryptocurrency so take take action guys you know learn a strategy and you know, i'm mainly a trader i do swing trade and invest mainly in bitcoin but i love trading and use this opportunity to learn if we do get that move up you can just see some of the coins that have gone up link if you look at it link has gone absolutely crazy one had a breakout celr today one of the trades i posted that had a huge breakout and there's loads of other coins that are breaking out so this could be a great opportunity for you to get started so thank you very much guys if you are interested check the group 
about uh, there's like there's other people that are posting there's news updates there's forex trading i'm live streaming you can ask me questions and we can work together if you're interested there's a special offer for the yearly still available the monthly offer uh, has run out but you can check out the yearly offer this was the offer that i posted uh, for 25 dollars and 30 dollars for the next three people the the monthly offers run out but you can still get the yearly offer if you are interested i'll leave the links below so thank you very much for watching if you want to check the group out that's fine if not guys just smash that like button subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification button every all my subscribers means a lot to me i'll keep on providing content on my youtube so make sure you you like that uh, smash that like button if you want me to make another uh, ethereum video uh, on ethereum 2.0 more about staking and more about what the fundamental is ethereum 2.0 let me know i'll make a detailed video comment below and smash that like button and let's have a discussion so thank you very much smash that like button comment below your price predictions for ethereum that's my i'll end the video with that question what is your price prediction for ethereum comment below and let's have a discussion so thank you very much smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video go ethereum